Hello friends, the teacher here. In this Windows 10 tutorial, we are going to talk about how to find the MAC address of your network interface device. Every network device or interface has its own unique hardware ID called MAC, which stands for Media Access Control. First of all, let me tell you that why would you need to find the MAC address. There could be many different reasons or scenarios when you might need to know the MAC address, but the most common aspect could be that you are setting up router and want to allow only specific devices to connect to the router with specific MAC addresses. You can also apply fixed IP addresses to your devices according to their MAC addresses and can later control their bandwidth users easily. You can watch our video to know more about those configuration. Whatever the reason could be, here how you can easily find the MAC address of your network devices. Open command prompt by right clicking on the start button. At command prompt, type ipconfig space slash all. If there are more than one network card installed, then first look for the adopter name and then find the values next to physical address, which is the MAC address of that particular adopter. In Windows 10, you can easily copy and paste contents from command prompt into Windows by first selecting contents from mouse and then use Ctrl C and Ctrl V commands to copy and paste. You can also find the MAC address in Windows as well. And there are many different ways to accomplish this. But the easiest way is to type view network connection in the taskbar search and then right click on one of your network adapter for which you want to find the MAC address and then click status. Click details button from the status window and there you have the physical address of your NIC card. Do note that status option will only be available if you are connected to that particular adapter. As you can see that both network interface has their own unique MAC address. I hope you will find this video informative and useful. Don't forget to hit the like button and do leave your valuable comments and suggestions in the box below. Subscribe to the teacher for more upcoming tutorial videos. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.